Final game before the holidays for UC women's basketball as the Bearcats set to take on Eastern Illinois Wednesday, 3 p.m., a new tip time in that one. Joined now by head coach Jamel Elliott. And, uh, coach, we're coming off a game, uh, your biggest win of the season in terms of margin of victory, 92-54 over Clarion. But as we talked about after the game, I think aside from the score, it really seemed like your team's most complete performance of the year. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun to watch. A lot of guys get involved, um, you know, a lot of excitement on the bench. Um, you know, we was able to – be rewarded for the first time in a long time with how you know well we've been practicing and how great our leadership has been so you know I was happy for the players and proud of the players and they, I felt like you know they didn't play based on the score you know we still tried to accomplish some things even down the stretch and you know that's the you know mark of a, a good team where they still want to work on things still want to run offense efficiently and it was again fun to coach fun to watch. You know, we've been talking all season about the growth of this team with so many freshmen, so many sophomores, and we mentioned, you know, with that, that last stretch of games, the the quality of play just increasing. We would see those, those stretches of quality play uh, get longer, come more frequently, and it seemed like that uh, on Sunday we had the most quality play of any game this season. You know, and, and a, another good thing about it was our minutes were probably the best distributed that they were all season long, you know, with the high band 25. So, you know, it was good to get them some game experience running up and down, still at a high pace. So, you know, the better game experience and shape they're in, the better off we'll be, I think, once we, you know, finish up the two non-conference games. Hopefully we'll win some wins, but more importantly, preparing us for conference play and, uh, you know, the competitiveness, the physicality, and understanding the type of level you got to play at once we do get in involved in our conference season games. It certainly is a good uh, a good place to be momentum wise as we approach conference play but we still got a couple non-conference games left uh, looking at this one against eastern illinois you know coaches often talk about these games right before the holidays sometimes can bring a little bit of extra challenge with you know 18 22 year old yeah. kids you know uh, obviously the holidays are on their mind how do you manage that uh, heading into this one always finding things we can get better at, you know, constantly keeping them on their toes, you know, challenging them by, you know, having competitions in practice, you know, and, and respecting our next opponent. You know, Debbie Black is a competitor. You know, I know she's going to have her team plan extremely hard, you know, and she's going to make us guard. And we have to be disciplined. We have to guard the pick and roll. Um, we have to challenge their shooters. We have to guard inside. So, you know, just keeping them motivated and keeping them hungry and, and wanting them to continue to get better, um, not only just in the performance of of our game but preparing to win uh, in practice so that's our job as coaches to keep them focused and in tune and not think about the holidays until we take care of business um, on Wednesday. Now, well, the focus can maybe be a little bit of an extra point of emphasis. You've been very clear all season that you've been very happy with, with the team's heart, the hustle, the the uh, preparedness coming into every game. That really has been a mark of this team. Yeah, you know, you have to stay the course. You have to stay consistent with how you coach them. You have to stay consistent with what you hold them accountable for. You have to keep our leaders accountable to make sure you know, the younger guys are continuing to get better um, in their work ethic and their pace. So, you know, this is a process, and I'm enjoying the process with this team this year, seeing guys grow up, um, seeing our leaders continue to emerge and be mature um, so you know we're only uh, uh, not even halfway through our season so hopefully we'll continue to get better um, and I'm looking forward to it. Yeah no doubt it's been a fun season so far and uh, a lot of big games coming up here on the horizon uh, again it's a 3 p.m. start time here on Wednesday as that has been changed uh, a good chance for everybody to get out and kind of get the holidays underway early and as we said before the weather gets too cold tomorrow night. Well we're looking forward to having uh, hopefully some uh, representatives from UC campus all over campus coming over and uh, spending some time with us tomorrow afternoon at 3 and hopefully we'll get some people out from the community play a little hooky uh, uh, get over here and, and get into some warm weather and enjoy hopefully some really good basketball. Should be a fun one coach thanks for your time we'll see you back out here Wednesday. Thanks, Matt. All right, that's head coach Jamel Elliott as, again, the UC women set to take on Eastern Illinois, a 3 p.m. tip-off here Wednesday at Fifth Third Arena.